Hi, my name is Brandon McElwain. I'm the Marketing Director here at State Tech, and I'd like to welcome you to another edition of State Tech Talks. State Tech's tailgate graduation is here. We are excited to be one of the first in-person graduations of the year. Now we're going to let you meet Nicole Engelhart from the President's Office, who's going to tell us everything you need to know about tailgate graduation this Saturday. Hey everyone, my name is Nicole Engelhart and I am from the President's Office and I want to talk to you a little bit about State Tech tailgate graduation on May 30th. First of all, we are so excited to see our students back on campus and especially getting to watch our students graduate. Soon to be graduates should go directly to the Vehicle and Power Center Automotive side as you see over here. When they get to campus, you need to arrive no earlier than one hour but at least 15 minutes before your ceremony starts. You'll put hand sanitizer on your hands and get your temperature checked. Get your cap and gown if you have not done so. Get a photo taken and find your program in one of our bays downstairs. If you would like to pick up your cap and gown early, you have until noon on May 29th to get them from the activity center. Okay, so I have a few key things I need everyone to know. One, our first priority is the safety of our students. Soon to be graduates, faculty and staff will be required to social distance at all times. State Tech has been in contact with the local Osage County Health Department. We will have hand sanitizer stations, temperature checks, social distance signage, six foot placement markers throughout the Vehicle and Power Center. Soon to be graduates can wear face masks, but it would not be required. We have a one vehicle per graduate rule. Vehicles will be placed by size. Parents, family, and friends will need to stay in or around your vehicle. Don't worry about pictures. Our marketing team will take care of pictures all day. We will send a link after graduation and the pictures will be our gift to you. We want this to be a true tailgate, but just like a football game, but please keep in mind that we have three different ceremonies that day. We are excited to show off our new State Tech trailer that we use at tailgate graduation. Let's go check it out. All right, here we are. Here's the stage you're gonna walk across. Um, don't worry, it will be ready by graduation on May 30th. Let's go see what President Strong is doing. Ready for tailgate graduation? All right, thanks so much, Nicole. Again, we are super excited about this weekend. Now, State Tech is here to make sure you are up to date on everything related to what's happening on campus, both this summer and for the fall semester. With each passing day, we learn more about COVID-19, its ability to spread, the severity of symptoms, and a variety of individuals. However, State Tech is confident it can resume near normal operations this summer and fall, but is prepared to continue operations in a variety of conditions. So please visit the site listed below for all the latest information. This will continue to be a great source for both new and returning students. And now it's time for our weekly State Tech Employee Spotlight. This week, we meet Tom Opa Markway. He's an instructor from our Computer Application and Development Program here at State Tech, and here are just a few of his answers. Question one, if you could learn to do anything, what would it be? He said, catch more fish. Question two, if you could be a fictional character, who would you choose? He says he wants to leap tall buildings in a single bound as Superman. Question three, how do you define success? He says, spending time with his family. And question four, what is your favorite thing about working at State Tech? He says, working with the students. All right, thanks Tom for taking the time to chat with us this week. Those were some awesome answers. And that's a wrap of this week's edition of State Tech Talks. So if you ever have any questions, you can always email us, statetechtalks at statetechmo.edu. But before we leave, just one last congratulations to the class of 2020 including my new employee, Michaela, who graduates on Saturday. See you next week.